Hi guys, welcome to another video on my channel. So this is a Q&A video, so meaning that I will answer a question for, from one of my subscribers, okay? So this question comes from uh, Foreign Drips. Uh, hi, great video. If you look at your thumbnails, uh, how do you put that glow around you? Uh, okay, so it's about the thumbnails and I will show you a free way to create a YouTube thumbnails with the combination of Filmora and Canva. Okay, so Canva is a free platform where you can design almost anything. And in my recent video, I just used Canva to to create my YouTube thumbnails. And you can see that it is beautiful, right? Okay, so let me show you the thumbnails first. Uh, for example, this one. And this is my YouTube thumbnails and I create with Canva. For example, I have a text layer here, here and also some elements here on the screen. But the question is about my myself so how do i create a glow around me so in order to create this effect you need to have a character with a transparent background and then you can add the effect to the image in canva okay so for example i can remove the background of my my image in filmora okay so let's go to my filmora for example here uh, let's delete this example uh, so first thing first i need to have some some photo of me Okay, for example, I can use this one. This is just a photo of me with the background behind me. And then uh, we want to drag and drop it onto the timeline. Okay, and being mentioned that you need to change your project setting to a widescreen video like this. Okay, and the next thing, we want to remove the background, right? And we want to go to effect tab right here. And then we're going to select this option, the AI portrait. So this is an effect that you can remove the background without green screen. By the way, it is a paid subscription plan. So you want to use this option to export the video, you have to purchase a subscription, which is about five or six US dollars per month. By the way, in my case, I will not buy this, okay? I just use this one, the human segmentation, and just run and drop it to my image. And then I'm going to click this option, try it because I'm not going to export to a video, okay? Just click here to try it and it removed the background. By the way, I want to adjust the effect a little bit. So I will double click at the image here and then select effect. And now I want to increase the thickness of the edge a little bit, just a little bit. Okay, too much. Okay, I think three is okay for me and I will increase the X further also. Okay, and then when I think it is okay and, and I can click okay. And now the next thing I want to take a snapshot of this image. So just go back to my media because when I take a snapshot, it will jump into the opening folder. Okay, we want to click this button to take a snapshot. And then we want to select the snapshot format be sure to select PNG so it will have a transparent background okay and then we can click OK and now I have my image here okay and now we need to find this image on our computer just right click and select review in explorer okay so it is here right in my Wondershare, Wondershare Filmora and Snapshot so the next thing you want to go to Canva Okay, so I'm going to open my Canva and this is the, the image. I'm going to delete this one. And now we need to upload that transparent image to Canva. Okay, so just select this upload option and then select upload file. And now you want to file it on your computer. So I'm going to select document, Wondershare, Wondershare Filmora and then I'm going to find the snapshot folder right here. Just double click. Okay, so here's the image that we want to use. Just select it and then click open. And Canva will upload it to, to their website. And being mentioned that Canva is a free platform for you to design anything. And if you want to try it, I will put the link in the description for you, okay? Okay, and now you want to select this image. Just select it and it will be here in your thumbnails, okay? And the next thing, we want to move it to here and then you can also resize it make it bigger also very nice right and I will put it right here okay and the next thing is the glow effect around my body okay you want to select the image here on the timeline and then click edit image 
and then you have the option here shadow which is my recent effect i can select shadow and now i can select this glow option select glow and then you want to click this button c control okay just click here and now we want to change the color to white because you see a white glow around my body okay just select here and then you can select the color white okay and now for the transparency i want to increase it to 100 percent so it would be like this and for the size i want to make it bigger okay and for the blurriness i can reduce or increase you know, it depends on my thumbnail so okay so in this case i can increase it like this and finally you need to click this option apply okay just click apply and finally you need to download this image to your computer and then upload to youtube and use it as your as your thumbnail for example i can click this share button to download okay and then i can click this option download okay and then select download to download the image to my computer okay just click here and it would download the image to my computer and we mentioned that currently i'm using a free version of canva and it is still possible to design anything okay so here's the image that we can use for our thumbnails this one very nice right all right, so that is how to create a thumbnails with free tools and Filmora 11. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.